functions, all teeming with life. I move through the dimensions, godlike, but still a man. A man gifted with great power. I am the creator. I am Bitor. I traveled across the universe, an exile fleeing my old world. I discovered Yamasol and planned to live there quietly. There with my mechanical companions, my creations. We had peace until my hollow children turned on the natives of Yamasol. Turned them into horrible machines. Like the gods of old, I poured my anger upon my hollows, crushing their plans placing them in a prison above the world they tried to conquer. But one day, there was an escape. She had been created from pieces of other hollows on the prison moon. But she was an innocent, unburdened by the corruption of her builder, Yari. Because of this, she bypassed the barriers I created and fell to the planet below. By chance, she met a native of Yamasol, a terrapin warrior who became her guide and companion. They traveled the wondrous world together for a short time. is not severed. A new kind of being, part living, part mechanical. When she returned to the prison room, she discovered that her incredible journey had changed her. Now, in her mechanical chest was beating a patchwork heart. And she saw with new eyes the eyes of her terrapin friend. Such strange miracles. Where will they take us? Prison Moon, an instrument of punishment, an act of rage and guilt built to house my mechanical creations. Their sentence for trying to conquer the world, forever teased with a view of Yamasong, always out of reach. Mother Yari wishes to speak to you. Secrets now? Who could keep a secret from you, Mother dear? You did well, my child. You found your way to the world below. Perhaps one day you will help us return with you. I don't rightly know what happened to me or how. Well, no matter. Go rest, darling. Perhaps one day. Mercury. 
murky darkness. Here they hide the tricksters. An ancient enemy of Yamasong sending soot storms, thousands of formless, angry souls to ravage the beautiful world. <laughs> the storms seek to feast on flesh, on the creatures of the planet below. of home. are getting bold. What is this one doing on our lands? Ah. Hey, Geta, are you going to listen to me or do I have to rip your play friend to pieces? <laughs> Calm down, brother brute. You can't let small things get to you. If you can't keep your temper now, what will you do if something bad happens? Maybe it already has. See that terrapin? Oh, uh, maybe he's just lost. relatives are harder to hide from than intruders. Think about who's more dangerous. Enough horseplay, Geta. Let's see what the Terrapin is up to. Perhaps we found a sacrifice. Hey, nothing to worry about, girl. We'll be back in familiar land before long.
You're trespassing, friend. Gyroscope, the heart of the prison moon. Nani comes here to listen to the rhythm of the vast machine, to draw comfort from its lulling motion. I wish I could float in the ocean I've watched from afar, rocked by its rhythms. Yet there's no water on this moon. Now that her mechanical body has its own heart, she feels a kinship with the machine. The other hollows are not allowed in this room by my design, but Nami was never part of my plan. A patchwork heart. The gyroscopic mechanisms of the prison moon were never meant to contain a beating heart. near that we return to rule the world below. Through the actions of our dear sister Nani, the ship's orbit has been disrupted and we fly to Yamasan. Our triumphant return is at hand. Nani may be too young to remember, but the rest of you, the rest of you remember our glory, our rule, or should I say, our service to the world below. We will walk free again and we will make everything right again. Are you with me, sisters? Nani, there is such potential in you.
goddesses. All praise, all goddesses. Decide your fate. They will free you from the constraints of your body, see into your very heart. A gift they bring to all beings. Tonight, when moonlight descends upon this temple, that gift shall be. Elder Masuk, I came as soon as I received word. Elder Pyres, welcome. News of the moon's disappearance from the sky can only mean one thing. If the Hallows escape from their prison, I fear they will return to their old ways. These are troubling times indeed.
Just get me to the water and everything will be fine. Everything will be fine. been summoned by the Hollow Queen. Any danger is upon us. I must get to my village quickly. Such troubling news. Gather everyone! Stop, traitor! Traitor? I've come to save our people. Your eyes? We'll let the elders decide. Dream the hidden forest. Place yourselves along the lantern path. A great many secrets wait for you. In a world. Master! Mm hmm? Apologies for the intrusion. Shojin has returned, but his eyes. You must come and see. It pains me, Shojin, but I have no choice. The news of the Hollow's escape had reached us, and the fact that you were there to witness it. I cannot help but conclude that you have been consorting with our old enemy. Your own words condemn you. But father, I've done no wrong. Is bearing witness a crime? I was taken prisoner by their servant, the Ovis. Don't you believe me? Enough lies. Look at your eyes. They tell us that you are more hollow than Terrapin now. What terrible bargain have you struck? You have violated one of our oldest laws. You have aided the criminal hollows. Shojin, we strip you of your rank as a clan member. Your staff will be broken, as you have broken our laws and your adopted father's heart. You'll be sent away to live as an exile. Seek, remember?
what they did with those mangled by their body factory. Do you know those places you are forbidden to go? <laughs> I've lost my clan. They no longer believe in me. What am I to do? My life, this life, everything was for my people. But now I have nothing. The hollows have returned and they threaten our world again. I must do something, even without my clan's help. You might not know it now, but they do need me. It would be childish to sulk and complain when there is such great danger in the world. Patchwork girl. dreamed of this ocean, to look at it with these eyes, and to see you again, Shojin. It's so good to find you too, Nani. Though, much has changed in a short time. Now I'm in exile from my clan. It's because of your people that I've been cast out of my village. I want you out of me. I don't want these feelings, these memories, these... these eyes. I want to be what I was before. I didn't want this fluttering, pulsing thing in my chest. I didn't try to use it to crash the moon. Things happen, but who can say why? One thing I know, it doesn't do us any good to be angry at each other. Do you feel it? Beating there where there should be a void. A hollow with a heart, it makes no sense. The world is changing. The sun sets and I hope in the morning it will still be here to greet us. Well, the night sky is lonely now. No moon to swim in its starry river. Its death brought your rebirth, but it will never again be in the heavens. Your sisters have done so much harm when they were last here. I only know the stories, but I hope we survive their return. I also am too young to remember, but I cannot abandon you. The one whose soul is tangled with mine. Sleep. My eyes grow weary. They tire like something living. If you want to tear up an ally to live, Hollow, you better tell me what your people are planning. Mechanical bodies, like ours, are the greatest gift we can bestow. We will bless the world. 
like our creator Pitor has blessed us long ago. That's the story I grew up with too. If I release you, you must promise not to fight me. I would not have harmed you then, and I wouldn't now after you saved my life back at the temple. I, I found the body factory, but, but also something much more terrible. Not all creatures put through the conversion come out right. There's a, there's a place these mangled unfortunates are discarded like pieces of misshapen trash. I can't believe this. Yari told us that the conversions are painless and there are no mistakes. There, there are, are always mistakes. mistakes. Come and see it with your own eyes then. This is too terrible for words. Did my mother, did my sisters do this? You must help us stop the hollows. But without our creator, Pitor, I fear that Yari is too powerful. But especially now that she has my people back in her thrall. Her army is growing bigger by the day. She's taking the best warriors and your brother? But there has to be a way. There has to be a way. The old stories tell that Pitor had a helper. Perhaps if we find him, he'd know about the Hollows and of their weaknesses. Yes. Lord Gear was his servant whom he spared when he went to face the Hollows. Funny, Pitor destroyed himself, but he couldn't bear to do the same to his creations. He put us on the prison moon. Lord Gear was given a safe haven. It's an island. I used to see it when my moon passed over the ocean. The island with the strange high tower. I saw it afar on many fishing trips. I could sail us there. Decided they needed to see the old fool clockwork. I hope it's not Yari. I know the moon is no longer in the sky, so the nasty creature has most likely escaped her prison. Gotten all about it by now, wouldn't she, Master? Yes, Gear. Help them. Must prepare for visitors. It's been a long time. Much has changed since I last walked among others. No, no, no! Stay down! Stay asleep! <laughs> Please, not now. I have guests. Watch your heads, friends. This old place wasn't really meant for one of your stature.
Oh, it has been ages since I've entertained visitors. Oh. smells wrong. This place has certainly seen better days. <laughs> this table's... table's cute. Uh. Please, please excuse the mess. we want to continue your master's work. The hollows are still as driven and dangerous as back in his time. And, uh, and you, uh, and you are the only one left who knows something about them. Now, can we do anything to stop their terrible chair? Master Peter realized all too late what he had wrought, but even he, 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 he. God, pardon me. Even the master could not stop them. Oh, the pain. I'm so sorry, but it's true. Please, do not be upset with me. My master had to call on a much more powerful entity, so dangerous for mortals, an ancient creature of the mountains. The mountain god, Yagim! Yes, Terrapin, to wake the immortal. You need to find his heart, the white heart of the mountain god. If you find it hidden deep within the earth, you will wake the sleeping god and stop the hollows as before. White ship, white heart. You speak in riddles, Lord Gear. Tell us, what is this heart? Where is it? B the heart <laughs> rests. Forgive me, do forgive me. Yari embedded her will in my gears. I, 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 I could not d disobey her. Master, I am weak without you. Madness, sheer! She's slaughtering them, imprisoning them in living metal. I've left my old world because of the wars there. How can Yari, my creation, my daughter, 
commit such horrible acts. Master, she took your actions and twisted them into her dark command. She saw you giving life to your new automata, and in her arrogance thought to do the same. Only she tries giving it to those who do not need it. This cannot go on. I will end it here, today. No, no, you cannot. Stop. What, what are you doing? Gear, stop this. I am your master. I command you to stop. Has the madness seized you too? Servant, you are free. M -m -m Master. soldiers have been hibernating for too long. It has scrambled their minds. Their overzealousness for combat has cost me my daughter. And that, <laughs> that is not good. You were supposed to bring her to me intact! Ah, uh, the office woman we've captured. She's your sister, isn't she? But to serve, we must abandon the family. We cannot look back. Oh, don't be so quick to dismiss family ties. After all, our service is to protect. Don't you wish to protect those who are closest to you, Brute? As you wish, Goddess Yari. You know what is best. You care about the entire world as if it were your own child. True, my captain. 
But isn't it remarkable how caring for the entire world makes you lose those you love sometimes? Do not repeat this mistake. Go to your sister. But I don't under... Yes, my goddess, as you wish. Why lay there broken and defeated? Come on, child. The conversion gives one new life. Just like the stories told us, remember? Just like we imagined when we were children, it's the dream of every Ovis. It is what we do. We serve the great goddesses to save the flawed world from itself. A new body will protect you from the suit storms. In a new body, new life, let me help you. Like our mother told me to, I am your elder. I look after you. You are not my brother. You are a shade of who he once was. This one. This might do. How about this one? It's nice, right? No. It's so terrible and twisted. And I feel another spirit within it, just like in all the others. These creatures are still alive? Not alive. I don't know what they are. It's some terrible half-existence I don't understand, but I can't abide. How could my sisters, how could Yari, the one who constructed me, let these creatures rot while a spark of awareness still flutters? What cruelty is this? F forgive me for following you, but I, I couldn't help but feel responsible for your body's destruction, dear hollow sister. But I am a gifted mechanic. Perhaps, perhaps I could help you. I don't trust you. When we met, you betrayed us to the Hollows. And it was a m mistake. I only sought peace and quiet, and then Yari, the Hollow Queen, r returned to my mind. I was not in control of myself or my actions. Then I have every reason to doubt you now. I mean only to help. And besides, do you even know how to build a hollow? I stood by my master's side for years, making his mechanical children. And my master guides me, even now. Shojin, perhaps we should consider his offer? I don't trust him, but for now. Okay, clockwork. Show us you can make a new body for Nani. And remember, I'm standing here with weapon in hand. There you are. That old useless fool. Still, he toys with disobeying me. No, please. You need someone to follow. <laughs>
Peregrine. You may want to know, your people are in danger. What danger? Yari and the Ovis are closing in on your village. How do you know? Let me share a secret. When I was linked to the Queen, it did not run in just one direction. I saw what she was planning. Then I'll leave right away. No! Well, I will come with you. Perhaps I can help. No, you, you seem to mean well, but I can't trust you. Stay here and build Nani's body. It could be a trap or a lie. But I can't take the chance of being wrong. Breather, yes. Can you generate clouds in here? I'm a conjurer. I can tickle sprites from the mist. I think they can free us. Then what can you do alone? Hush, dear friend, this is my fight. I'd rather die protecting my home than live exiled from it. For your safety, Nani. Maybe a skilled warrior among your own people. Your moves are slowed by the metal and mechanics you have adopted. Let's hear your prattle when I skewer you, Toad. Ah! Sloppy. We're not alone, Nani. And look, it's Get Up with friends. Ah!
Serviette <rire> Brother, relatives are harder to hide from, but you won't die this day. Some of us who haven't gone mad. See what the hollows offer? Protection from the killer soot. Warrior, how long can you keep this up? Oh, you're on the ground. Oh, 
we could help, join us, and then we can take this battle to the tricksters above, the real villains. Let me be your refuge. Not for the sacrifice you ask. <laughs> Run and see if it solves the problem. Let the sun consume you then. We will return to pick through your remains. Father, he's been calling for you. Father, Father, I'm sorry. I came too late. Hush, foolish boy. It is not your fault you were cast away. If we, if I, hadn't made that terrible decision, you would have been here with us where you belong. It is I who should be sorry. I am old enough to know that the law should be seen through loving eyes. Forgive me. No, oh, no, no, there's nothing to forgive, Father. And you mustn't regret anything. You fought so bravely today. I know that you never abandoned your people. Take this. My son, it will be of use to you. Bathe in the blood of diamond stones. It cannot be broken. It will obey your command. I will not fail your trust in me. Now, the hidden forest beckons me. Lead. My son, with wisdom. Sleep, father. Travel well. I see the treetops as I approach the one tree itself. Its great boughs welcoming. The sky glitters a million eternal stars. 
The hidden forest beckons me. Find your body. For now, you and I will travel as one. You will be my sister, my other eyes. And you will be my other heart. We're still too few. We must stop Yari from raising her army. The Hollows were not born villains. They were twisted to become that in their battle against the tricksters. Maybe we can reverse things. Remember the heart of the mountain? Let's seek the heart and hope it gives us answers that are better than death. I know where to find the white heart of the mountain. Goddess, we have taken the prisoners and begun to convert. You will soon have more soldiers for the war ahead. Very good, my wild brute. Tell me. Yes, Goddess. Why do they continue to resist me so? When I offer them the gift of protection from the soot storms, why do they continue to rebel? We offer them life over death. I cannot say. But their days are numbered. With each moment our ranks grow stronger and stronger, theirs dwindle. Surely they will understand and come to side with us before the end. It is the way of progress, my goddess. Shojin, you better come with me. The rest of you, wait here. Keep watch, my brothers. Raise the alarm if the hollows arrive. I know this ship. From Yari's stories. This is Pitor's ship. Didn't he die here? Hmm? Come. There is more inside. Whoa, 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 we shouldn't disturb the dead. I am not afraid of the dead. If the dead could speak, we would simply ask. But since he can't... This one has left us a gift. Right. I feel like myself. At last, I can move again. Even dance. See? There will be time for dancing later. Help me with these controls. I do not know these letters, and none of this makes sense. I think I can decipher it. This dial here, it controls this power source, and it seems to reach deep into the mountain. Legends make it all sound like magic, but it's not. 
This works by remotely controlling the flow of geothermal heat in the depths of the mountain. I think Pitor had used this power to awaken the creature. It's connected to the mountain, and the changes within it can either waken him or keep him in deep slumber, like this ship has been this whole time ever since our exile to the moon. Well, I see you found the White Heart, the exile's ship. I had to follow you, to tell you I have freed myself, and to see you discover your destiny. Stay away. Stay away, you wretched clockwork! I truly wish to help. I realize you have your reasons to, to doubt my s sincerity, but I assure you, I carry a deep shame about my betrayal. However unwilling, I, I w wish only to prove to you that I speak the truth. I can help. I came here meaning to carry out Pitor's last wish. To awaken the mountain god. To silence the hollow threat. How can we know you're not lying to us again? Following my mother's orders. Let me do this one last thing. You shall see. Let me stand by your side and wake the mountain god. I say let him try. We were all former enemies, joined in alliance. Couldn't any of us betray the rest? This is why we came here, after all. But we'll need to ensure the Hollows won't interrupt. It's up to us, then, children. Let Nani and old TikTok try and wake the god, and the rest of us will distract the Hollows. Attack them. You said so yourself. It will likely be dangerous. And we are warriors, are we not? Who knows, we may succeed and... and I may get my brother back. Then we go. Nani, I don't know if I'll be coming back. Please don't speak like this. Surely you'll return. We've been through so much already. I feel like we will see each other again. You are a part of me. And knowing you has changed who I am. I thank the gods for that. May we meet again, patchwork girl from the moon? <laughs> Small army. the same set of hands, I am stronger than you are. You need someone to follow. I came to talk to you as an equal. It is a deep urge, isn't it? You still want someone to obey? No, please. So be it. Obey me, Yari of the Hollows. <laughs> my, my precious daughter. daughter. My child. 
Why have you strayed? Mother, how could you? You told me that you cared about this world. I do. You only need to come back and see. Come back and all will be forgiven. I need you for the greater war ahead of us against the tricksters. Not in a thousand years, I will not join you. Haven't you learned your wars have solved nothing? I've learned by living among the creatures of this world. They would choose freedom and life, even with its suffering, to protection from harm and an eternal life of loyalty to a master. They would suffer the soot storms instead of being slaves to us. What does it matter what those incapable of reason would choose? They need us. Oh, Mother, please release the poor old clockwork. No tomorrow! and I will stand up 
your mother's eyes. The mountain god has awoken, and it's a disaster. What's happening? Gear, what are you saying? He will wipe this world clean of all life if he continues like this. Oh, what have I done? didn't end like this. Legends never tell the full truth. They are only half understood whispers of the past. The so called God is too dangerous a solution. There is no one left to stop him except me. Am I no better than Yari? Seeking a cure worse than the disease? <laughs>
Rest, friend. You've done well. The madness... It's over. My happy scar. I know she was so wrong, and yet I can't help but grieve for her. My mother. I wonder if there was anything anyone could have done to help her. Couldn't she be saved? This is the original Yari. She's the one that came with the exile from the other world. You're going to try to save her, aren't you? Tommy! No. Sister. to start over. This is where we begin. Children of the Earth make a home with descendants of the stars, defying the rules and alliances of the past. Strange miracles abound, hope grows, and Yamasong heals. 